Hi there everybody, my name is Chris and I'm part of the Galileo FX support team. Today I want to show you how to install our software on the MetaTrader 5 platform. So when you've purchased the software, you have received a zip file with the software itself. To extract it, you're going to right click, extract files, and you're going to extract them to a conveniable location for you. After it was done, in my case, I've extracted everything to the soft, to the desktop, as you can see here. We are going to bring up our MetaTrader 5 platform. We're going to go over to File, Open Data Folder. We're going to close down our MetaTrader platform. And we're looking for MQL5. This is the file for the platform. platform. We head over to Experts, then we click on Advisors, we open it up, and you can see the files that the software came with. Now to add our software, you're going to have to open the Install Galileo FX file, and you're going to copy over the MetaTrader 5 file from here. to here. So it's currently added in here. We're going to close these two up and then we are going to open up our MetaTrader 5 platform again. There we go. Any second now. There we go. So you can see that you have the navigator bar in here. Again, if the navigator bar is missing, you can go to view. Then you have navigator here. You just click it once and it's going to pop up here. Once this has been done, you go over to expert advisors. You click on the little plus. It's going to bring up the advisors file. Again, the little plus. And we can see that the bot has been added here. Now to add it to the chart, you select it and then you just drag it on the desired chart that you want. Let's start with Euro to USD. You drag and drop it on the chart and it's going to bring up this window. We always make sure that in the comment tab, these two are selected. Then we head over to inputs and this is where all the magic happens. This is where you modify your settings. Um, initially, you can use our settings file, which you can find over at galileofx.com slash settings. You're going to have the link in the description. And you look up the currency that you're applying the software to, euro to USD. Now, for some currencies, we have multiple options because we found, well, multiple options that actually work. Then you can see you have the numbers here, you bring up your MetaTrader platform and you adjust them. You select the part that you want to adjust, double click, backspace, then you modify the lot size, take profit, stop loss, and bullish and bearish signals. So six and five. And then you click OK. And you can see the software popped up here. In order to modify any settings, you can just double click on this little icon here. And it automatically brings up the page. Very important, make sure you also check the time frame. And you modify it. So in this case, M15. Select the chart. If you cannot see the time frames you go over to view toolbars and you select time frames and it's gonna pop up here so you select the chart switch it over to m15 there we go then you rinse and repeat the process so you select it you drag it you go over to common make sure these are always selected Switch over to inputs, you bring up the settings page, and you look for the currency. 
SQL to GPI. And then you just simply bring up your MetaTrader platform, double click, backspace, and we modify it. There we go. 200 and 0. We check the bullish and bearish signals. 7 and 5. Then we click OK, we select the currency, and we also take the time frame, which is M15 as well. Just click on M15, and see it switched it over. After you've done this for all the charts that you're trading with, you can click on Algo Trading. It's going to have a red little square like this. It's going to switch over to this green arrow. And the icon also lit up if you take a look here. That means that currently the software is trading. So that was about it for the MetaTrader 5 platform. Thank you very much for watching this tutorial. Catch you guys on the next one. Cheers!